Welcome back to Tools and Techniques with Johnstone Supply, the Balsam Group. I'm David Darling. I'm your technical service advisor over here. And we will be going over today um, how to charge your system in the middle of winter without turning it on. So it's the middle of the winter and you need to charge a system that is sitting outside. Your 410A can has most likely been sitting in your van and is also relatively cold like the outdoor unit. So we need to get the pressure of the can higher than the pressure of the outdoor unit. So we do that by using a little bit of domestic hot water, a five gallon pail. So now that we have domestic hot water, which is 120 degrees typically, doesn't get over 140, and we know that our 4108 tank will not get to a point that's too hot for the tank itself by manufacturers. And we're just gonna put our uh, gauges on right now so you can see the pressures on the tank and then watch them rise. As you can see, we've got about 203 PSI in the system right now. Now that we have our domestic hot water, it's time to dunk the tank in and watch that pressure rise. You just leave it in there, and now we can see how our pressure is rising up. So now that the pressure in the can is much higher than what an outdoor system is in the middle of winter, then we can easily get refrigerant from the can into the outdoor system. Heating the refrigerant allows us to charge the system without putting in the cooling mode because who wants AC in the middle of winter? Using domestic hot water to do this instead of a heat gun ensures we will never get to dangerous pressures. Johnstone Supply the Balsam Group is your partner in HVACR. If you have any more tools or techniques you'd like us to cover, please leave a comment below. Thank you for watching.